What's up guys and welcome back to 72T, it's Jim here. In today's video, we're going to be doing another tech video on Netflix. And generally in this video, we're going to be telling you how much internet SD Netflix uses, HD Netflix and 4K Netflix. So hopefully you like today's video and we're going to talk a little bit about it today. So um, yeah, stay tuned and let's get it started. What's up guys, so we're going to show you basically how much internet um, Netflix uses per hour and this can be in three different ways, SD, HD and 4K and basically we'll give you a general idea so if you've got 4G and you're limited to um, how much internet you got such as just say you got 200 gig this gives you a bit of an idea how much you can watch and so on and also if you've got MBN and you're limited to maybe 500 gig this will give you a bit of an idea basically showing you what plan you should subscribe to if you don't have much data you can use and um, basically how much it is going to use per hour. So I hope this video gives you an idea. If it does, let us know down below and um, let's get started. And we've got like a little grid menu that's going to pop up on the screen any sec. And first up, we're going to show you the SD one. So SD, we'll start off now. So basically SD quality. So the SD quality pack is called the basic pack. And basically that generally will use per hour 0.3 gig and um, 0.7 gig, which is, if you're not too sure what that is, that means 300 meg or 700 megabits, uh, megabytes right there. Um, so that's what that is. So that's gonna be your basic, so your standard definition, not HD, not 4K, will be very low, won't use much at all. As I said, the max it will use is 0 0.7 gigabytes right there. So very little data at all. You can watch a lot of stuff. So if you've got short data, like um, maybe 200 gig, or something like that, that is perfect for you. Again, you won't be getting crystal clear um, TV. So it'll be a little blurry because it is gonna be SD definition. However, if you've got unlimited internet and you don't mind how much internet you're using, you can go the HD pack. So the HD pack is going to be called standard and standard will allow you to watch anything up to 1080p. Now that can use up to three gig to five gig per hour. So again, it's getting up there. So if you've got unlimited data, you're fine. So that will be your standard pack. And then lastly, obviously is going to be your uh, premium pack. Now premium uses a heck of a lot of data. This will use up to 7 slash 14 gig per hour. Now that's a lot of internet. So if you're on 4G and you've got a limit of 200 gig, that will not do, you'll get a few movies out of it, but not too many at all. Because just the, how much it's using like. If you watch a 4K Netflix original movie, it's a good chance it will take 14 gig off your data plan. So yes, it can chew up your data really fast. And um, yeah, 4K is the biggest at the moment. Um, that does use 14 gig. That's the biggest um, that I've noticed. It does take a chunk out of. Um, I don't think it will take any more. Again, if you are watching a two hour movie, it's gonna be double 14. So remember, it will take up a lot of data if you don't have unlimited data. So keep that in mind. So I'm hoping that gave you a general idea how much internet basically Netflix can use. I thought I'd make today's video just in case you're curious, but 90% of the time when you sign up to a new plan, it is pretty much unlimited, except when you're with 4G and some MBN providers, sometimes it's not unlimited data. So you just gotta be careful, because um, as soon as you use all your internet, your internet can drop, especially in 4G, it can drop to 1.5 megabits per second. Now luckily within that range, you can actually watch SD, but you are paying for 4K, so that means you can't actually get your 4K content, but sometimes when you're using the 1.5 megabits, Netflix will buffer and load a little bit, and then you'll end up what you'll upgrade to HD, which is pretty cool. I've noticed that happens a few times. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to give you a general idea basically how much internet Netflix can use, and if you don't have an unlimited plan, what Netflix plan you should join. So let us know if you found it helpful today. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much everything that I wanted to pretty much say. Now, one thing I will actually add in, if you're wondering how much internet or how many megabits per second you need for 4K to work. It's actually 29 slash 23 megabits. So if you've got anything between those uh, megabits right there, so 23 to 29 megabits, you can easily watch um, 4K content. So keep that in mind with Netflix. If it's anything under that, like 10 megabits, it may only go to HD. So keep that in mind as well. So yeah, thanks again for watching. If you've got any questions, let us know down below. And we'll catch you guys in the next one.